compared to the salary and wages of 2012, 2012, um, we, we uh, utilized $4,121,000 for salaries. This year, 2013, we're looking at $3,930,000. Um, and operating ex and expenses, uh, 2012, we were at $6,538,000. Um, 2013, we're looking at $8,575,000. As you can see, I have Director of Top Operations, Amanda Sanchez, here with me. Um, for the most part, uh, our budget has stayed the same for right now. Uh, the golf operations has some significant increases, and I think it's the best of our model plan himself. But we will go through the budgets as the director draws the animal um, division at that time. So we will start with the director's office. Um, the the 2013 uh, budget uh, for the director's office and parks and community renewal is two million eight hundred twenty-three thousand um, dollars. One million eight hundred thousand dollars of that is in salaries. Um, there are eighty-five employees in the Department of Parks and Community Renewal. Nine hundred nineteen thousand dollars is in other expenses. Those other expenses are basically uh, our our peace program or some of our special trail side expenses, uh, disabled straw and hay, uh, movies. Um, our horticulture department was does a lot of plantings throughout the year, and that is exactly the same number as it was in two thousand and twelve. Um, in planning and community development, there is a slight increase um, in, in salary. Uh, it was $919,000 in 2012. It is, in 2013, we're looking at $974,000. Um, it appears to be an increase, but we'll be getting a reimbursement for individual salary from the NJPPA when we submit um, the salary. Um, the expenses uh, in, in uh, New development are basically the same, such as twelve hundred dollars savings. There's a twelve hundred dollar decrease from last year. Um, Culture and heritage, um, two hundred thirteen thousand, two hundred thirteen uh, budget is two hundred six thousand uh, dollars, two hundred six thousand two hundred ninety six, um, as compared to uh, two thousand twelve, where it was uh, two hundred thirty nine thousand um, dollars. Uh, our, our department can redevelop pretty much more of that department with the retirement of Barbara Fuller, who was, who was uh, in charge of uh, I'm sorry, culture and heritage. Um, there has been some increases in salary there, but there's still a $33,000 savings uh, compared to last year. Um, expenses have stayed the same in culture and heritage, and that's just to, uh, they do get a lot of grant dollars, but it's basically uh, funding for team arts and, and different uh, senior arts programs, et cetera, throughout the year. Um, in the uh, information technology uh, division, um, 2013 budget is $2,522,000. Last year it was $2,562,000. Um, salaries um, have gone down. There was a, uh, a job elimination there and also a retirement from the, from the department. Um, the overtime has gone down a little, a little bit, but our expenses are exactly the same. Those expenses include licenses, our, so our software, rentals of our copiers throughout the county, and our, our payroll and finance systems. Um, I'm gonna uh, jump down to planning and environment on this page, and I'll say, uh, golf operations uh, for the last five years. Uh, 2013 budget is $323,000 in salaries. Uh, that's for four individuals. Uh, last year was $399,000. Um, the expenses have stayed exactly the same. Once again, that's mostly planting and tools for our, our volunteers, the Park, and Park, and Trail stewards. Um, but once again, uh, the numbers are pretty much uh, pretty much lower than last year. Um, if we go to golf operations, um, what we're looking at right now is uh, for a total of uh, $5,655,000 as compared to 2012, which was $3,613,000. Um, it is a $2 million 
increase. And, and unfortunately, uh, I'm punting the ball to Armando now to give you more details for that. I was happy to bring you good news. Chairman, through you, uh, in order to increase, to basically explain the increase of $2 million in the, in the operating expense, we also, I should talk about the increase in revenues that we're going to be anticipating with the clubhouse and the opening as well. That anticipated revenue is going to put us at about a total of $6 million for 2013, and that's again, that's conservatively using our golf revenues of about $4.2 million. We used the projected uh, total revenue that we hit last year of four point six. We went back to where we had similar weather, not the greatest weather like we did last year. So we went with a conservative number of 4.2 million in golf revenues. The additional 1.8 million that we're going to see in revenues that we're anticipating with the clubhouse opening between banquet events as well as the restaurant being open. Uh, so there is an increase of 2 million in operating expense, which is mostly new salaries of employees that will be operating at the new clubhouse, but as well as the expenses that go on with putting on these events, the food and beverage costs, uh, primarily are what we're going to see that increase in. But we will, uh, we're all setting it with our increase in revenue as well. Sorry, what's the net? What uh, we're going to project the net is about 400,000 this year. What's it uh, in the black? In the black, correct. Right. Yeah. And we're being conservative. Because uh, as of today, we are we're approaching we're already approaching seventy plus events booked into our clubhouse. Um, just to, just to follow up on that, we are the final inspections are being called for for next week. Uh, we had a hope to have it open this week. Uh, it just didn't work out that way. We had some work that needed to be done in the kitchen as well as our elevators, which tend to be a little tricky. Uh, it's kind of a moving target work with the elevators. Uh, but we are calling for final inspections for next week, which will give us uh, hopefully a soft opening later at the end of the week and get full swing by the, the week of the fourteenth. By soft opening, uh, really just opening the pro shop, uh, getting people in to see that we're going to get to use the facility, but not opening the restaurant just yet. We're going to open the restaurant the following week. Thank you.